Hey guys, I hope you've been well. Um, so I came up with this idea, my team and I, um, of a weekly video log for you guys. We're gonna call it ATV. Is that Adam Taylor Vision or Adam Television? I don't know, but it's clever. And uh, anyway, I wanted to start things off by telling you guys a, a story. It's probably the most ridiculous thing that's ever happened to me in my entire life. I'm sure if you've ever been to a major city, you probably have a crazy story about a crazy person, which I would love to hear. So send me a email or a video response. Anyway, I was outside of this cafe. I, I go to this cafe every day to do my work because I don't have Wi-Fi wi at home. Um, and I was outside just minding my own business. and. You know, it's, it's not odd for people to come up to me and be crazy, but uh, this crazy guy came up and he said, have you met my friend Recto? And I wasn't really sure what he was saying, if he was saying rectum, but he said, no, Recto, have you met my friend Recto? And I said, no. So he puts this sock on his hand, it's a pink sock with the grips, you know, and he goes, Recto, Recto, Recto. And I was like, oh, wow, neat. And he's like, yeah, you know, Recto is the front side of the book. Verso is the back side of a book. And I was like, oh, okay, cool. I didn't know that. And he's like, you're always welcome. And I'm like, okay. So he goes inside. I go inside. Whatever. I th kind of think nothing of it. Just a crazy guy. Um, but he's like staring at me the entire day, night. And uh, I go back outside to leave. And he's out there playing the guitar. Now, at this point, I was like, I want to get a picture of this guy. He's crazy. Maybe I can just upload it to my Facebook, you know, tee hee, crazy guy. Um, but, so I approach him about getting a picture of the guitar. And I say, hey, you know, nice guitar. And he stands up right away with the guitar and he goes, here, take it. What? And he's, take it, give it to your dad. It's Ruby. Tell your dad I found Ruby. Give it to your dad. And I'm confused. I don't know what to do. And I'm standing there still like, I, I don't, I, I here. Give it to Ruby. Give, give give Ruby to your dad. Tell your dad I found Ruby. So I, I take the guitar because I don't know what to do. I'm just caught off guard. The, the man walks up, um, goes back into the cafe. I, and I stand there for a while. I'm like, oh, what do I do? This is crazy guy's guitar. Do I take the crazy guy's guitar? I don't know. And he eventually comes back out shortly after and points to a van. He says, if you don't leave, I'm going to give you this car. Uh, okay. And he's like, here, take take the case too, put it in the case. No, tell your dad that the man who wrote the Antichrist is back on tour, okay? Give your dad Ruby. Give Ruby to your dad. Tell your dad I found it. And I was, I was like, okay, okay. So I put the guitar in the case, and he's like, oh, I'm not going to make it, but you, you are. Um, which was kind of cool. Crazy guy telling me I was going to make it, even though he didn't know I was a musician. But anyway, I have his guitar. This, my friends, is Ruby. My new guitar, given to me by a lunatic. Now, Ruby here is probably one of the ugliest acoustic guitars I've ever seen in my life. But I looked it up, and it's actually a, a pretty nice guitar. It plays really well. Um, if I had any dignity, I would play it live, but um, I think I'm just going to keep it in my bedroom, unless the crazy guy comes back and says he wants Ruby back, because I didn't give it to my dad. <laughs> so, 